Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make chicken wings which are easy to make in within 10 minutes and so so what you'll need is a kg chicken wings one cup white vinegar one teaspoon salt and a uh, and a jug of water now let's mix it all together and then i will leave it for half an hour I put enough water into the chicken so it will dip, not the whole jug of water. This is half an hour later and I've just drained all of the chicken from the water and now we're gonna marinate it. The things you'll need to marinate with is a teaspoon of red chili powder, a teaspoon of salt, tablespoon of garlic powder and a tablespoon of ginger powder also a tablespoon of chicken tikka masala Now that I've marinated it fully, we're going to leave it into the fridge for half an hour. Now all you need to do is watch closely. What I'm going to do is put the chicken wings into the, uh, and marinate them into the flour. And then I'm going to put them, dip them into the water and then I'm going to marinate them again. The real thing about the chicken wings and the zinger burger the crunchiness on it i have said this in the video before for my kfc chicken zinger burger is the bending you have to do the bending with the hand and just follow the way i'm doing it you need to push squeeze and then let go and push squeeze and just repeat that you want the flour to get inside every single cut of the chicken and not just onto the surface of the chicken Basically, you want to let the flour enter the chicken. Now that I've marinated it into the flour, I'm going to take it out and dip it into the water one more time. This is normal tap water, not cold nor hot. This is going to be a perfect way to make chicken wings. Now I'm going to take out the chicken and just like bend it into the flour again. You'll see this will be the perfect chicken wings. Also, if you want to make it more spicy, you can add chili to the flour and mix it and then bend it. But I'm not adding anything into it, not in particular, it's just plain flour. As you can see, I took it out of the water and now I'm bending it one more time. These recipes are really helpful for the people who want to eat junk food, but they can get junk food because fast food restaurants are closed. But I think we can all agree that this is way more healthier because you know what you're putting into the chicken and it's just homemade chicken and I guess homemade cooking is way better. As you can see, the chicken has really good crumbs on it. Mm. 
This is exactly what it should have on it. Now I'm going to fry them. This is very hot oil. And don't worry, the oil won't splatter at you because it's co coated with flour. Now I will take this out and show you guys how crunchy and good looking it is. Also if you have an electric fryer, you can use an electric fryer, just put it into 160 degrees Celsius. You're gonna see how good the crunch is. As you can see, it looks already crunchy. I think you guys should just make zinger or burgers or whatever you want at home. Also, if you guys have any recommendations for what new video I should make, feel free to comment down below into the comment section and I will be here to make it. The chicken only takes 5 to 10 minutes to get ready and it's, my one's almost ready so I'll show you guys the finished look. Some of them are done. As you can see, they look very crunchy. Now I'm going to put the rest of them and I just want to make a small clip for it. This is the wing done. And look at how crunchy they are.